The next morning we decided that we'd head into Paris to do a little bit of sightseeing, but not before Surdy had treated us to an impromptu performance of a classic Elvis number. Hang on, this isn't Las Vegas, this is France! Centre of Paris at the Arc de Triomphe. It's an amazing historical landmark. We've got no real interest in it though, so we're going back to Leeds to train with David Bell. Bonjour. We're here outside David Bell's house awaiting his arrival. We're going to go and do some training in the forest. As it turned out, we didn't have time to go into the forest itself, but after a short walk through Leeds, David helped us with some climbing techniques. Now, climbing this wall is actually more difficult than it looks, and after a few failed attempts from members of the group, David demonstrated how it's done. How easy was that? That was amazing, it was really swift. For the next hour or so, David spoke to us about his approach to training. He spoke to us about the importance of being focused and shared with us some advice on the mental approach to training parkour. Here you can see him talking us through a large running precision which, although none of the group quite managed to achieve, his advice gave us a real insight into the importance of both mental and physical preparation for obstacles such as this. With such a short run-up, the jump was proving difficult to achieve, so David offered some suggestions about tackling this problem. Then David explained to us the dangers of performing for cameras when out doing parkour. It's true that that, for me, it's dangerous. And for him, it's not dangerous. Why? 
Parce que dans, je sais pas, je sais pas comment dire ça. Non, c'est à dire que dans, quand tu vis un truc, tu vois, j'ai pas de téléphone, ouais. j'ai pas de montre, j'ai ah rien. Oui, et je suis que dans ce que je fais. Si quand je fais un truc, on me dit attends David, le photo, je, ça me casse. Ouais, tu vois, j'ai besoin d'être entier. Et des fois, il arrive des accidents parce que le mec il filme, fait ok, ok, vas-y, attends, ok, ok, bah ouais, je Et après, bah, bah, bah. Et là, je fais ok, c'est à cause de la caméra. Non, Nico, est parce que je crois que c'est que Moi, je crois que si aujourd'hui j'ai bah, tenu le coup dans un sport qui est dangereux, c'est parce que j'aime ce que je fais. Et par contre, c'est bon. Our session with David Bell was coming to an end, but we all appreciated the time he'd spent with us and everyone had learned something. Afterwards, Godfrey and Danny discussed what David had told them about his first big jump off the seven meter wall when he was just 19. He, he told me that it was his uh, first big jump, you know. I said this one, first big. Uh, but he told that he, he jumped at, um, it wasn't like he climbed up the jump, you know. He was just climbing to the uh, middle of the wall, turn and jump, you know. Then he climbed to the shelf, like cat, turn, jump. After a lot of training, he was climbing, climbing, and then he jumped from the top. But it looks, it doesn't look that hard from the bottom, but from the top, it looks like a massive jump. Yeah. Huge. Yeah, we're talking about big jump, but I think the training was good, you know? Yeah. Show us the way. That's it. After an amazing week, our time in Lease was coming to an end. So it was time to reflect on the time we'd spent there. We're nearing the end of our week's holiday. It's been a great seven days. I've laughed more than I've laughed in about a year. I've had some great training. But now it's time to go back. I can't wait till next year. As the conclusion of our lease trip, uh, as you've seen, we've had a great time. We've done loads and loads of stuff. Uh, join us next year, or it's going to be even better. Ah, oh, we've had a great time in lease. But now it's time to pilot the plane back to England. Hello. I'm just about to take a seat. Oh, our flight's back to Manchester. Don't worry, but we'll be back in no time. Biswold, come on. Act lively. Wigan, Wigan. What have I told you about serving drinks? Chop chop. Oh, we're back in the UK. Yeah, it's been a long flight. Mm, that was a good flight, actually. Well done. You piloted that plane nicely. Thanks. That's good. Uh, but now that we're back, you know, it seems like almost like it never happened. Yeah, it does. I mean, it's so bizarre. The fake Jan, David Bell, those crazy, crazy Polish guys. I know, yeah. Who would have thought it? I mean, it seems like a dream almost. Sometimes I wish we could be back there right now. Yeah, I wish we could be back. What if we could be back? Wait, you talking about the time machine? Yeah, that's exactly what I'm talking about. Are you sure it's not dangerous? There's a minor possibility we may implode. All right, forget it. Let's do it. Well, let's try. You ready? Let's do it. Yep. Let's go back to lease. Did it work? I don't know. Are we in lease? Oh fuck! We're in lease. I never told you. Don't act like I told you. Uh. Don't act like I told you. Don't act like I. Strength's raining for Paco. Told you.